much for we're gonna jump right into Yoshi's so that makes a lot of sense Let me also see. Already a really, really intense match. Um, good pressure on the Nair there. Doesn't get the dash attack follow up. How does he get back on the stage? Interesting to go for the up smash call out. That might have been an error. Right. And also a bit of background for those of y'all who might be getting some deja vu. Title number five, these two met twice. Ginger won the first set, lost the second set in a game five in loser semis. Last week they met in winner's finals with Ginger winning 3-0. So Ginger's up 2-1 uh, in the matchup on unti uh, at Untitled. Uh, again, net play, take it with a grain of salt. Um, but looking pretty good in this game one here on Yoshi's. Yeah, good awareness to realize that he could dare there and start a combo. Um, obviously attacking from ledge can, is something that you can call out pretty aggressively, but you know, if you're reacting, mm -hmm. just barely misses the window for up smash. Up smash is actually like a surprisingly decent combo starter, but obviously it's like not something you're going to see regularly. Mm -hmm. And the thing I, I feel like I always have to talk about, but it, it's crucial to how sets go for Gatsu. It's usually these first couple of games aren't are a little rough, and he did just reverse 3-0, or at least take game five cents against Falcos. Gatsu, it always feels like the first game, game and a half is data collection, and then later, oh, and that sucks to see there from Gatsu. Um, but it always feels like the first couple of games are this data collection, and then once he gets a read on what his opponent's doing, he starts just decimating them. So let's see if that's able to come a little bit faster here, and it's been pretty back and forth. Double is from the ledge. Yeah, I th I, he's definitely a downloader, although I think that uh, Ginger is definitely the kind of player that adapts pretty well, too. So I think it'll be interesting to see what they kind of mix up. Good reactions, though. Just a little bit late on yeah. the up smash. Maybe looking for an up air there, but nonetheless, not going to get punished for it. But will Ginger get out of his opening? Smash. Yeah, really nice forward smash. Nice tag. Really good air dodge, though. Ooh. Love the nair there, but he slides off and grabs the ledge. It's a good call out. Has he... Uh, Deal with invincibility, light yeah. shield, yep. Okay. Oh, good. Nice. Good up air. Okay. <laughs> Real heads up play there from uh, Gatsu, the react to that, and that should probably be it. Oh, Randall's in play. Uh, Randall, yeah, could definitely be a factor. Mm. Still in play now. Ooh, no! Oh, no! Down smash, forward smash? Yeah, just barely misses it. Yeah. It's a problem with the back throw. It doesn't really set you up in certain situations. Okay, reaction. Okay. Interesting. Seemed a little a little too big brain. Not really needed to go that far. Could have just rolled up. And so one of the things that Falco can do against characters that have bad recoveries is laser F tilt at high percent because it basically knocks them off stage in a really safe way, and then you just edge guard them. So we're probably gonna see that a lot at a higher percent, just because Falcon's recovery doesn't suck, and there's a lot of stuff that higher level players do to mix it up, but it obviously isn't his strength. Nice mash there from Ginger staying awake, doing the get up attack to cool him down, okay. Working those laser heights that Radar was talking about. Oh, for sure, yeah, not only that, it's like, Pressure is a huge part of this matchup. Like, Falcon just isn't super great out of shield, so Falco can kind of smother um, uh, Falcon, and then he just, like, can't really do anything. I really like Ginger seeing that all hope is pretty much lost for him regaining that stock, trying to maybe cheese him with that side B there. But he should get this kill pretty soon. Ah, fades back, but not far enough to miss that, and we're playing a three-stock game here in game two. That is the weird part about forward smash is it has a hitbox that almost goes below the, or it does go below the stage which is something you wouldn't expect but it really helps for edge guarding falcon that's why you see him use that option quite a bit i really love that that jabs the pressure is shielded then reading the roll for ginger getting out of there getting the cover okay i like the fade back laser to still put on pressure but get safer oh, good reactions nair oh, back air and then call out the down air Ginger swings the lead back in his favor. All right. Got to really... Okay. Falco. Falco dying real early. Um, that is the thing. Like, if you get off stage, you're just kind of screwed, so... Yeah, I was about to say, it, it felt like 
the lead was building in Ginger's favor, but both these characters just mess each other up so hard that they can die at any point. Ginger making Shine, real good proof of that. Oh, yeah. yeah, that's good. Yeah, do just it. something he hadn't mixed in, so it's a good, op good uh, option to go for. All right. Gatsu's going to need something big off that one. Catches the forward smash. Okay. Like the edge cancel like the there. the edge cancel. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Ooh, yeah, I want to see Gatsu take the stock Ooh, soon, or oh, he's going to take an L. Good slide off. He's been kind of opting to go for dares rather than kind of like getting him up in the air, and it hasn't really been working out because of uh, uh, DI. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, this is really tight. Cravage. Mm -hmm. I actually really like the decision not to try to grab edge there just because he doesn't want to risk anything. He's in such a good spot, and if he gets off stage, he could die. Oh, no. Yeah, like, this could be it. Oh, no. Good DI to grab edge there. Oh. Oh. Oh, no. So, I mean, it's, like, oh, it's it. closer than it looks. We're going to see the F tilts again. <sighs> Tornado winner right, back right. air. Yeah. All right. It seems like in both those first two games, Gatsu's getting so close he's just starting to put the pieces together and then ginger just flips over the monopoly board like start over we're playing a new game oh definitely I, I think like he's doing a good job of mixing stuff up throwing out options that he like only has used once that he doesn't expect it and really good forward smashes it's looking gross here from ginger oh god that's it call it the down yeah. oh yeah, he's just going to roll up, and that's a, a clean stock there from Ginger. Gatsu, no who has taken the past two Falcos he's played in bracket before this to game five. Ginger looking to end that streak here and move on to play against Rishi. Loser, this gets fourth. And I, I again, this is where Gatsu's runs at all these events have ended before. Oh, no! Oh. That's the crazy thing about Falco is he can just, like, bully falcon and then if you're not able like if he's controlling space well if he's not giving you a lot of openings then it just kind of looks like hopeless i don't want to go that far but like it just yeah it's really hard we need to see yeah got to not getting anything out of that side okay that'll work we're just we need to see those classic jaw on the floor combos from Falcon from Gatsu here that he definitely has in him, and we've seen before, even on Netplay, but it needs to start coming now. This would be a well, good this could example. Be it right now. Yes. Another knee. Good DI again to grab ledge. I'm really liking those up airs out of shield. Back air's nice. Goes and gets them. Okay. Gatsu coming alive. Pretty classic edge guard. You go off stage, you do an aerial, and then you follow it up with up air, and Falco's just dead. Nice shorten. Would love to see Gatsu at least take one game here. Ah, oh, man. I think it's not super unlikely. Ginger's been kind of like forcing situations, and Gatsu's been getting more and more openings. Just the spacing is a little off. Okay. Right. Oh. <laughs> oh, okay. Gatsu reeling, realizing how perilous the situation, not in any mind given that homie stock, but they're one stock apiece. This could be Gatsu's life in this bracket to finish it fourth. Or it could be the first step in a road to getting another reverse 3-0 on a Falco. Really good shine. Ooh, okay. Oh. Oh, this could be big. Oh, nice. Nice getting out of there from Ginger. Could have been disastrous. Nice back air. Ooh, oh. oh, my gosh. What a brilliant fair. To just, That's going to be the it. the only way he could extend it. Yeah. Wow. Fantastic play by Ginger. Ginger is good at melee. And continues to prove it every single week, eliminating Gatsu at fourth. Yeah, that was really clean. I think just a lot of stuff you can learn in terms of the matchup there. Just like minimizing uh, Falcon's strengths generally. So like if you don't give them openings and you like really pressure their weaknesses, like their poor shield game, you know, how easy they are to combo, it can be really, really rough. That was a super cool fair though. Fair to F-Smash. I'm definitely uh, stealing that.